So hey guys, welcome to my channel Joints and Pain. So uh, today in this video we are going to uh, talk about or do some stretches and exercises for carpal tunnel syndrome. So let's get started. So carpal tunnel syndrome it uh, happens because of the compression of your medial nerve which runs through your arms and and goes through passage in your wrist which is called carpal tunnel and ends in your hand. So it affects mainly in your wrist and your fingers except your uh, little finger. So it generally affects the motion of your wrist muscles and your fingers muscles and the movements affected to these muscles. So uh, this is generally because people who uh, work on computers while typing uh, and also who spend a lot of time uh, on their mobile phones, uh, on scrolling. So these activities may generally uh, affect it to your wrist or your compression. Sometimes it may cause pressure on this medium nerve. So uh, this compression causes you pain. Some patients can say, uh, some patients say that they have a pain and numbness in your in their hands and also a tingling sensation or a burning sensation in their hand also the weakness felt in their hands loss of grip grip pain. so uh, in this video i am going to teach you or show you some five best exercises of carpal tunnel syndromes which you can do anywhere anytime you want and it's very easy to do and uh, it's very less time taken so uh, move into the exercises so our first exercise for a first stretch for a uh, carpal tunnel is uh, wrist extensor and wrist flexor so uh, make a fist like this place in front of you like this and do the up and down motion only move your wrist do not move your whole uh, shoulders so only move your wrist while doing this Or if you are comfortable with the alternate, like if you want to do on one hand first because you cannot stable the both. So first uh, you can stable uh, your hand with the other hand uh, on your elbow and do the up and down motions. You can also do this or also do with your both hands. It generally depends uh, on you. So. Uh, these activities, this, this motions, like up and down motions, do it for 10 times, at least 10 times and then gradually increases uh, and do it in a pain-free uh, range. Exercise for our carpal tunnel is the prayer stretch. So generally if people uh, uh, feel a tingling sensations throughout this motion, so generally it's, it's a very minor and it's, a, it's normal, it's okay. You do not have to uh, worry about that because uh, it usually happens in this exercise. So if you are uh, feeling a tingling sensation after the exercise, uh, so please uh, attempt this exercise in a very low and less intensity. So in this stretch, uh, press your hands against to each other like this. It's like a prayer stretch. So like it's a you are uh, doing a prayer. So sometimes carpal tunnel is misled too because of the compression of your uh, now of in your neck region. So this is the best exercise. Hold it. Press against each other. You can feel the some sensations are going around in your uh, arms and relax. Hold it, hold it for thirty seconds and do it for three times. Or also, uh, if you want to increase your intensities uh, according to your pains, if you are feeling a uh, generally uh, usually. Uh, if you are feeling a burning or ting tingling sensation throughout this exercise, please do not do this. And also, you uh, decrease your intensity by doing these exercises. 
Now moving on to the other exercise, Same. Uh, making a face, but in a radial ulnar deviation. So uh, without going up and down, you have to go this. It's an up and down motion, but in a radial ulnar deviation. So it's it's except to this. Place your fist like this and do this. You can also do uh, with your one hand and then move into the other hand. Uh, yes, first is uh, do not move your whole hand, only move your wrist, otherwise, you won't get any uh, better stretch or any relief while doing this exercise. Okay, do this also for 10 times. So moving on to the other exercise for uh, carpenter syndrome, it is wrist extension and wrist flexion. So in this exercise, I'm just putting, uh, so putting hand in front of me like this and for extensor, extensor stretch, just with the help of your other hand, stretch it, pull it backwards and hold the stretch for five seconds at least will give you the stretch over your extensor muscles and relax. So stretch is like uh, same but I am in this I am not making a fist so uh, placing my hand in front of me like this and gently and hold the stretch for 5 seconds and also 5 to 10 seconds and relax will give the stretch over my flexor muscles. Now our last exercise for those who uh, it's a severe cases if, if people are people felt uh, there is a weakness in their hand or they lost uh, grip in their hand so uh, uh, I do not have a tennis ball here so if you have a tennis ball or any kind of ball or any kind of thing which you can grip easily so uh, take it out and grip that and perform this uh, gripping exercise like this do it in all move all your fingers in this kind of motion with your tennis ball or any kind of uh, sponge or any kind of spongy balls with this it increases your grip in, in grip intensity and also in, enhances your grip and also uh, strengthen your muscles or your wrist muscles which is lost because of the carpal tunnel. So these are some five best exercises of carpal tunnels which you can do at your home anytime. It's very easy to do and very less time taken. You can do anytime, anywhere. It's not uh, that exercises which take uh, uh, 45 minutes or 40 minutes of your whole uh, routine. So uh, try these and uh, do let me know in the comment section. That's all for today. So if you like this video, please share and subscribe to my channel and learn about some more exercises and stretches for your pain. Till then, stay fit, stay safe.